movement is life. Oh my God, this is something I'm so passionate about and I love that I have this platform on which to share this with you guys because I share this with the people who come to my movement classes. I share it all the time. They're probably sick of hearing it, but maybe you guys need to hear this. Movement is life. And I'm not just talking about, come to my Pilates classes, lie on a mat, let's move your body. Let's go to the gym and exercise because it's going to make you healthier. I'm talking about movement. I'm talking about moving from where you are now to where you want to go. I'm talking about creation, movement. The reason I write movement with a T at the end, like a capital T and a capital M, is because there's a massive circle of love in movement. A circle of love between your body, your minds and your soul. Every single cell in your body, non-physical and physical, they all want to move. And when you move with me, we all go together. I gave an analogy to my class the other day about if you're herding a bunch of children and you're trying to get somewhere, you don't jimmy up the ones at the front. I don't know. It doesn't matter when the ones that are leading the movement get to the restaurant. It only, you can only go together. So you all have to wait for the ones at the back. That's where you want to jimmy up. That's where you want to put your um, focus. That's where you want to put your care and your love. So you get the ones at the front who are able to lead to come around behind the back, hold hands with the kids at the back who are going, I don't want to walk anymore. And suddenly you all get there quicker because that circle of love is about all of you. All of you moving in the direction that you want to move. And where do you want to move? You want to move towards a life that you love. I'm already living a life I love. Okay, well, you want to, brilliant. You want to move towards a life that you love even more. Because what is living? Creating. Living is experiencing. Living is connecting. Connecting to yourself in every moment, in every experience. Connecting to others in every experience. Experiencing things with others. That's what living is. And therefore, with every moment that you live, every experience that you have, you changes, which drives a need and a desire to connect to you more. How have I changed? It's not about analyzing or understanding. It's just energetically understanding, oh, this is me as another. It's not a version of you, but it's like, it, this is me in an evolvement. Yeah, consider this. You might not be believing me at the moment, and I can sense that. So consider this. Every time you take a breath or you blink your eyes, you've changed. Why? Because you've got a body that's just taken another breath. Those muscles have worked again. You say to me, oh yeah, they do that all the time. Yeah, but they haven't done 987,000 breaths plus one. And now they've had to take another one with 980,000 and one breaths. See what I mean? You're different every time. Every exercise you do with me, every repetition of the exercise you do, you're different the next time you do the same repetition. Why? Because your body's just done one. So if you don't believe that you are changing, have a look at your body. Your physical body is constantly always changing. And that's not just true of your physical cells. It's true of your non-physical cells. So why do I say that movement is life? Because you can't live without moving you can't live without changing movement is change right especially movement with those two capitals because it's all of you moving together if any of those cells are lagging behind and some of you are like we're off over here are you coming there's a call to them there's a soul call you are designed to grow to evolve to expand because that gives you an opportunity to experience more and to connect more and that's what you wanted from your life so if there are some cells that are lagging behind, you want that connection. You want all of you to move as one. And that is what that circle of love as move, of movement with those two capitals is. Moving as one. Moving as one energy. Moving as you. Which is why my movement classes are called Move With You. You move with all of you when you come to a movement class with me you'll find that sometimes those movement classes are physical moving. And often 
they will always involve some kind of physical movement. They will always involve some kind of energetic movement, movement of your minds, movement of your soul, movement away from habitual patterns, which could be housed within your physical body, but could be housed within your energetic minds as well. I don't care, really. My focus is that you are moving because movement is life. You can't live without moving. You can't move without living. And this is why movement to me is so important. And it's why movement should be that important to you too. All I want for you in this moment is to recognise energetic recognition of the powerful change maker that you are that it is held within your hands to create the life that you want to live and it doesn't have to be highbrow it could be yeah I can choose what I have for dinner tonight hell I can choose whether I go out to eat I can choose what I'm doing this weekend I can choose how I do that bit of work for my boss and if you're ever in a position where you can't choose how you create, just take a look because movement is important. But what's even more important is movement with those capital letters, moving from all of you. All of you wants to be a part of the change. If you move with all of you, there's a power in that. You're basically moving with every little tiny creator Every cell in your body is a little minion that's a little creator, and they all want to be involved in the creation. If you move with a percentage of you, it's not as big a movement. If you move with all of you, it's impactful, it's influential, it's purposeful, it's full of passion, it's full of you. Maybe that's playfulness, maybe that's love, maybe that's peace. But I promise you, if you move with all of you, you will get where you want to go faster and you will stay there. It will be a longer lasting change. And then when you get there, guess what? I'm not interested in the definition, the destination. I'm interested in the journey. And I know it's contrite. But when you l- learn to love the movement as opposed to the getting there, When you learn to love the creative process as opposed to the thing you're creating, it becomes limitless for you because you go, look at what I've created. Isn't that amazing? My God, that makes me want to create something else. Isn't that amazing? That's what life is. A collection of experiences where you're moving with you. A collection of connections that you move towards with you your experiences will be more satisfying, more fulfilling, more satiating. They'll be exactly what you want because you're moving to that experience with all of you. You're not just doing it with a bit of you that thinks that that's probably the way that other people would do it. You're going, this is what I want to do. This is the way that we do it best. You're bringing your own magic. So guess what? It feels less efforty for you. It feels like you're totally in your passion. In your genius, it will feel funner, it will feel more good, and it will be dripping in your magic. So it will impact people more greatly. And all this world needs is more of you. If you move with all of you, we get more of you. Why is that important? Because you are epic and you are awesome, and there is no one else out there like you. I just want you to recognize how important you are. And therefore, the change that you bring, the movement that you take is important too. Imagine also the connections you forge to yourself and to others if you're moving towards that connection with all of you. That person recognises you. There's a truth to you. There's something that they can grip onto more. They kind of, it's, it's an energetic recognition because you're in your truth and you're moving towards them with all of you that, You light up and they go, yeah, I can connect to you more deeply, with more ease, with more fun. And guess what you do? You call them to more of them so that they move with you for them, if you see what I mean. They're moving with all of them. 
And when you move towards each other and form that connection and you're both moving with all of you, wow, there are fireworks. Wow, those connections will light you up even more. Wow, those connections will bring you to a more of a connection with yourself and bring you to more experiences that are more fulfilling and satiating and enjoyable. And that's what I want from you. A life that is dripping with love, that you love to live your life because it's dripping with so many experiences that couldn't be better. Or could they? Because you can always move. (laughs) And dripping with connections that couldn't be deeper and more fulfilling. That's the life I want for you. Where does it start? Starts with movement. Number one, accepting that you want to move. That movement is life. That it's a part of you. And that movement can feel so damn good as long as you choose to move with all of you. If you want to experience things, Move, moving with all of you look at my still movement classes come and join one of my move with you classes there are online version as well as in person i'd love to move with all of you but mostly i'd love to move with you and see you move with you the world needs you and it needs you to move <laughs>